POV or the pizza. Go. <laughs> hey guys, it's G. So for this week's video, it's going to be a little bit different from the type of videos you usually see me put out. I had something different planned. I filmed it, but tactical difficulties, I just decided not to put it out. Something happened, whatever, it's a long story. So instead, I decided to create this video. Now, I feel like I'm really putting this video out for myself. I mean, my YouTube channel has been a reflection of my growth and what's going on in my life. And if you connect with my videos, that's amazing. Thank you to those who watch me. But um, my channel is really for me. And today is gonna be a very, very raw, very authentic, genuine video of me just kind of talking about what's up, kind of like an update. We are extremely shorthanded. It's been literally me and Mike every single day in the pizzeria working. Do you wanna say hi? Yeah. This is Mike. Hi, Mom. <laughs> You're gonna leave a comment. She leaves a comment on all your videos. Yeah, Did know. you know that? So G and I have been working every hour that this store is open. The store, this location is open for more than 70 hours in a seven day week. So it's been busy. It's like a Monday through Sunday and it's been busy. So it's been busy. Either one of us or both of us has to be here for every single hour the store is open. So just so you know, if you get a pizza from us, it's made by one of us. Yes. Um. Basically, it's taken a toll on us. Obviously, you can hear my voice. It is gone. It's a lot. It's a lot of work, and I don't know if G mentioned it already, but her video that was supposed to come out today, uh, there's technical difficulties. The cameraman, whoever that was, must have been so dumb. <laughs> but the cameraman had his hand over the microphone the whole time, and that person just must have been an idiot. It's okay, but listen, instead of sitting and crying about it and getting upset, I decided to take a more graceful approach and think about what we could do instead. What can I do instead, instead of being upset at whoever, whatever the circumstance. It's just an opportunity to create something real, real. This is what happened. This is, this is how it is. This is a reality. This isn't social media where everything's perfect. This isn't like the perfect YouTube video vlogger or whatever. This is my life. This is what happens. I literally come into work with Mike all the time and to find the time to edit these videos to fuel my dreams. I can't just do it in the comfort of my home all the time. Like I have other responsibilities, you know, we're at the pizzeria, I edit in these dining rooms. It's just making me reflect a ton and it makes me think about instead of what is going wrong, things that I'm grateful for. That's something that helps me stay sane and stay happy. I'm so grateful to have such an awesome partner to help me like mentally and be there for me also physically and work with me and you know basically be a clone of me it's amazing that i have him i don't know what i would do if you weren't here maybe i'd be crying then but i'm really well no because you have a video that doesn't have a messed up audio <laughs> shut up well on that same note i'm very grateful i have you to help me. obviously this isn't my responsibility this isn't my family business but i'm very grateful that i have you i love helping you i love supporting you i love your youtube videos i love being in them <laughs> shout out mom for watching i'm grateful i know you i'm grateful i have your family my family, and there's so many things I'm grateful for. Mm -hmm. And working all these hours doesn't change that. But these people do. <laughs> <laughs> so I wouldn't call this like a pizza vlog. I wouldn't call this I wouldn't call this like a pizza vlog. It's not a pizza video. This is just a very raw organic video. I just want to be very honest with people who watch me yeah. and honest with myself. Even though it feels like things are terrible right now, I'm really trying to reposition my mind and think like this is just building character i keep thinking about my unique story i was born in the pizza business i have this desire to create videos and to connect with people online it makes me so happy and not putting out a video today is just not me like i won't stop like i need to put something out i made a promise to myself i manifested it At the beginning of this year i said i will put a video out every single wednesday and i am a woman of my word i have been doing that but I will be very, very honest, it has been really difficult. And like I stated before, like I stated. Mike, I said like I stated. Uh -huh. Yeah. Like I mentioned earlier. As you stated. 
Yeah, like I mentioned earlier, these videos are for me more than they are for anybody else. This channel is a reflection of my growth, my journey, whatever you want to call it. I feel like putting content out is me manifesting my dream, manifesting what I want, and putting this video out is me telling myself, like, it's okay, you're gonna grow from this, you're gonna become so much better for yourself, not for anybody else. The reality is, this is from me. You know, and if there's somebody watching this who also connects with this message, that's that's everything I could ever wish for. It's just been really tough, you know, 2021, running a business, nobody wants to work, everyone's at home doing, I don't even know. I keep reflecting on how blessed I am to have the mindset of wanting to work hard and wanting to do things I believe in and not stopping for anyone or anything until I achieve it. And I think there's definitely comfort in connecting with people online who feel the same way because it makes you feel like you're not alone because we are humans, we are meant to converse and you know, grow and live together. And it's all about finding those humans who have the same values and same, you know, thoughts about work, thoughts about dreams, thoughts about life. It makes me wanna get out of bed every day, you know, knowing that I'm needed here. You know, people come into the pizzeria to see me to eat my pies. People going on YouTube to watch my videos, like even if it's two or three people. I remember when I was like, oh, I just want 100 subscribers. And I'm like, why does it matter? If I connect with one person, that's all I should want. I keep thinking about like other YouTubers and like what makes me different? What makes me different from these people, from these content creators, because everyone's different. And for me, working in the pizzerias make me different and <clears throat> they make me a little bit rough around the edges. and. You are pretty rough, but you're very smooth. Shut up! <laughs> Can I say something now? Yeah. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for watching her content. You could be- no, I'm serious. You could be watching so many other things that are just- just aren't real. I appreciate you watching her content because she is the same in these videos as she is outside of them. Uh, we've had so much fun. She's all smiles. She's all great energy. And there are times when we get down and we talk about real stuff and you're watching Juliana. It's not some facade, it's not some fake thing. This is who she is. She's a beautiful person. <laughs> she has so much love in her heart and so much positive, beautiful energy, and she's real. You want genuine? This is it with a capital G. <laughs> so, just thank you for watching her content, and I really feel like you're doing yourself a favor for watching this instead of watching something else, so. Uh. <laughs> That's what I was just saying. Um, He's very sweet. Your content's awesome. Thanks, Mike. I love your content. I always like, comment, and subscribe too. Something that's really cool about Mike is, you know, I'm still, we're young. We're young adults, and I believe that you never stop growing. And part of that growth is believing in yourself and what you have to put out and what you stand for. And a lot of times when I feel down about um, what I believe in and my dreams and if they're attainable or not, yes, my siblings for sure, my family, but Mike um, as well, they're really good at reminding me why I'm doing what I'm doing. You know, like everything you just said, it's like, you know what, you're right, like, yeah. I guess it's really important to have people who believe in you, like truly believe in you around in your life. And like I mentioned, like I stated, if you connect with my videos, you might be one of those people and you're a lot more important than you think you are to me. That we believe in Truthfully, you. like I'm not just saying like you guys mean so much to me, like actually, like that's the reason I want to film this right now. It's the reason I want to put this out. It's the reason I want to keep doing and making videos and doing Twitch and connecting with people all over the world. It, it really brings me so much joy. Like you could ask Mike, every time I turn on my stream or I put on a video, I'm so excited because I'm like, oh my gosh, like these people are connecting with me. Like they must have something in common. They must agree with the way I think about this, the way I work, the way I live my life. The best thing about social media is you get to find those people no matter where they are in the world they exist they're proof that those types of people exist and it's it's a very very beautiful thing it gives me hope it really does I've always wanted to connect with people I've always wanted to entertain I've always wanted to make people happy and smile I believe it I believe it to my core I just believe I'm going to connect with people make people happy give them content that's gonna uplift their spirits you know I've been really thinking about like what motivates me to like get out of bed every morning, what gives me the spark, what makes me enjoy life. And I actually watched Soul again. It gave me a lot of perspective and made me excited about life, made me think about how all we have is today. All we have is the present. Instead of beating myself up and feeling like I'm not good enough or all that, like in the end, am I growing? I'd like to say that I am.
and I'm really proud of myself. If you're one of those people too, be proud of yourself, and I'm proud of you, if that counts for anything. Anyway, that's pretty much what this video is about. It's not a perfect roses and rainbow type of life. Sometimes life gives you the old. Could you please pick those out? <laughs> anyway, if you made it to the end of this video, I just want to say thank you so much for listening to me and watching me. It means more to me than you'll ever know and this is for you if you two are going through a tough time like me just remind yourself that it's making you stronger and it's building your character and no one can ever take that away from you don't take life too seriously but take it seriously in the way of making the most of it because you only have today you only have now and in the end nothing really matters but right now this moment so thank you for taking this moment to listen to me and hopefully this gave you some kind of comfort. Tis on.